So let's take a look at the games in game store. First up is the Gasha. So you can see here we got a number of choices. We have the Knights, we have the Caster, we have the Shagiran. I guess that's what these unicorn like creatures are called. Shagiran. And an important thing to note is that these ga Gasha, they have both the female and male separated. So you can choose. And let's take a look at which should we look at first? You can see what's inside the sets. You can take a look at their appearance. You can try them on. So you can do things like that, but also you can take a look at their rates. And we can see here the S ranks are 1.2%. So it's quite low rates. And since there's six different clothing sets, that's 0.2% for each of those. Should we take a look at the mounts? The mounts are also 1.2%. So those are pretty low rates. As for what else you can get... Not this one. Which one? This one's better. Uh, so this is the S to A rank stuff. I don't know what this is exactly. It's a box. Can, well, actually, can I see what that is? I guess it's a unique weapon skin. I think it's a little bit different from the ones you can buy elsewhere. Or, I mean, the ones you can get from uh, as weapon skin tickets. So it looks like kind of a unique weapon skin as one option, but... Otherwise, these were the A ones. You have the, the Fox Ears things. Cattail. You have some you, rare dies, I guess. Black, white. Tuning tickets. I don't know what these are. Ability keepers for your equipment, I guess, when you switch things around. And what does tuning do? Yeah, I'm not exactly sure what the tuning does. I think you can re-roll like, your weapon or something like that. And then you, with these ability keepers, you can keep the ability that's on the weapon when you re-roll it. And there's some other dies and other things, but at this point, it's like, are you going to even want to be paying <laughs> however much for just like a couple dies or two 30-minute increased drop rate things? <laughs> Probably not. Probably A and up is what you want. But even the A, A and up is what? 12%? <laughs> So that's pretty expensive. The Rose Orb store, we can see what's in here. So we can buy with Rose Orbs. They have their clothing, so you can buy underwear if you so choose. Remember, these 200, 200 Rose Orbs means like... Maybe like $15 or something. <laughs> Which is pretty expensive. Especially just for like underwear or something. Though they do have their special edition... Uh, what was it? They had one of these sets. These special edition packs right now. And this comes with underwear in it. So you can get the underwear with a mount. And an earring and some other things. All for like $45 or something. These are basically the same things we saw from the stream though. There's some earring choices, various accessories, clothing, rose orbs, the BP store. So yeah, this is where you can spend BP. So 12,000 BP points can get your choice of one of the unlockable things. Unlockable sets, right? It's like the armor sets. You can get there directly, but 12,000 BP points seems like quite a bit, especially since you only get... I think 100 BP points for like a whole season from the paid season pass. <laughs> so that, yeah, it seems a little bit on the, the high end. I don't know how much you get back from trading in the things you don't need. So you can change in things you got from the Gasha here to 4 BP. But I'm not sure how much you get. I think the best value is probably the advanced season pass here. Because if you buy it once, you keep it. 
All right, you, you can keep it, uh, get the next season for free as long as you go through the whole thing. So I'll, I'll probably end up picking up this at some point. Which seems like a good value. Just being able to have that on always. I guess you can pay to increase your season rank. And then they have the season store. You can use the season points to buy certain items. You can get like a jacket, a fire jacket thing. I don't know about that though. <laughs> I don't really want it. <laughs> but that's one of the things you can get. Can you get the gosh gotcha currency for free? You can get Gasha tickets for free and some of the BP points for free, I guess. There were some of them were in the season pass. So there's 10, but it's 10. You needed 12,000 to be able to get one of the outfits, right? And you only get like 10 here, 10 here. 10 here. That's like a hundred, maybe like a hundred or so. I haven't looked at all of them, but maybe like a hundred at max from like the whole season. <laughs> BP points. Which is not, not too much, I don't think. <laughs> Especially when you need 12,000. And then what is, what, I guess there's daily quests or something. Where are those? I think I can see those somewhere. I did get some things cleared here, so let's get some rewards. Uh, let's see, so daily, it doesn't show anything right now. I'm not sure if I need to get the... Season pass, or if it'll just update at 4 in the morning here. They have the weekly quest and they have the season quest. It's not just not showing up things. There's the bonus quest they talked about. And then there's also the login bonus. Let's see where you can check that. But some of these uh, bonus things here. There's five Gasha tickets here. So with these five Gasha tickets, and I think there's maybe five from the login as well, you may be able to get 10 pulls, which wouldn't be that bad. I need to do a rush battle, which is one of the later on like missions to like fight enemies in our arena. Where can I see? Can I see the login bonuses somewhere? I'm pretty sure you can. I forget where. Season pass? No. Login bonus. Here it is. So, login bonus, you can get 40 more BP, <laughs> but still. 12,000, right? <laughs> 12,000 be able to get the thing. But what do we got here? Um, there was a special. So there's a special login event currently. This gives you three Gasha tickets. So I guess you get around eight altogether. And then from the season pass, are there any Gasha tickets? There's one there. One there. So maybe just from the Gasha, you should just get the things you get from in game. Use those. To do like a 10 pull on something that looks nice. But I think the next next month might have better things. They probably have the swim stuff. Maybe like summer. It would be cool if they had like uh, Japanese like summer outfits or something. Kind of events elsewhere. Right now this is kind of an event where they have like the special login bonus stuff. And the special bonus quest going on right now. I expect maybe they have some you can get elsewhere. Next month they have like a summer event. Maybe they'll have like some rewards during that too. Yeah, right now these login bonuses. This is a login bonus event happening currently where you get some Gasha tickets. And I guess a few rose orbs here. So with 50, I guess you could probably get something. Maybe. <laughs> I'm not sure how much you could really buy with 50 rose orbs. But you can save them up. There's a few things going on here. But that's a look at the, the cosmetics and the shop there.